All right, so this morning, I got to find out, and um, it has been on many blogs, Sheila posted uh, a, a threat by somebody that we don't know on the life of his daughter. Somebody sent the wife message. The threat to say they will buy his daughter away in London. You understand? And according to the gist, when he gets this money with me, he said this is not the first time that he has been getting the threat since before the election. So... He can't decide to post them and voice her this morning. And I think we should talk about it. You know, number one, like Peter Obi said, there are many people disguising as obedience that are not really obedient. There are many people who have been pushed from other parties to join the obedience movement. They will be causing problems here. Like one way they claim saying a uh, deputy chairman for Labour Party that are not obedient. So, the real obedience don't carry out problems. You understand, this is politics. We cannot take it to people's families and start threatening their families, especially those that are not politicians per se. When elections come like this, everybody will get an opinion on who they prefer. We should try as much as possible not to fight ourselves. We can disagree. You understand? We feel quiet. We feel disagree, but you know, it can't be threat to life. Like issues like this, you understand? Uh, all this to say, we know they know who they do then. We are, if we know who they do, and then all of us go fish on and condemn the person or change that for the person. Like that person will go to soft flight. You understand? Nobody supported that person. Nobody that can obedient or non obedient supported that person. And the same thing we will not support this one. But that somebody sent a threat to life to anybody does not mean the person is an obedient. Please, anybody can do it. From the name I would see, I yes, said this person not be like Nigeria. Anybody, the person can be a supporter of PDP, he can be a supporter of ANMPP, CPC, if he even be a PC supporter. Because nothing that not do. But please, if you are obedient, let's keep our cool. Leave them in the case for there. We'll argue along political lines and achievement lines and we'll argue with, with the boundaries in place. You understand? Which is healthy for everybody.